Hey yo, welcome back to Nunderson everybody. Now, got a lot of stuff to say here. The last stream is a must watch. You can watch it on my Twitch. It'll eventually be up in YouTube if you're scared to go to Twitch. I know a lot of you are. It's very scary to type in a website URL sometimes. But, lots of stuff happened. Now, I fought a lot of bosses, alright? I fought a lot of bosses. Now, I usually don't like to progress on stream, but I was forced that somebody put a gun to my head. I swear. Somebody put a gun to, to my head and they said, you better fucking progress that, boy. You better run that progression, boy. So, uh, I'll let you guys see uh, what we have left here. <laughs> we fought the Lun Lunarians? Lunarians? I still don't know. No one has ever told me. Uh, we fought the Spirit of Purity. And we fought Supreme Calamitas. And Bumble Burbs. Four bosses. It was all f for good cause. Don't worry. But yeah, you can watch all that on the stream. It was like a two hour, some almost 30 minute stream. I don't know. Yeah, we're going to go and fight the Lunarians this episode. Lunarians. Whatever. We're fighting them this episode. Now, I think I was supposed to fight them a lot earlier. Because not to be, um, not to sound like I'm overpowered or anything. Because I am. They died pretty damn fast when I fought them. Hey, let's do some quick tour touring real quick. A lot of NPCs died during some fights. Uh, I think the Supreme Calamitas fight. I'm not going to tell you if I won or not. Uh, you guys can see on stream. So a lot of NPC switch and also peep this. Boom, we down here. Guts the Tracker. That's a bad name. Look at this. We got we got the, the Mineshaft homes popping off here. We got the Challenger right here. Look, why not? Look at this. If you shot from him. What the fuck? What is all that? I don't know what Astralite is. I don't, there's supposed to be an NPC over here. Oh, no, that's him. Okay, we got like the grungiest looking NPCs. And the Challenger. Because I'm a kind person. So, let's get to it. We're going to fight the Lunarians using either OP weapons or not. I don't know. We'll figure something out. Do we just fight them straight up? I think it needs to be nighttime at least. Okay. So, we got Voxa, Dustite. There's a lot of bosses from this. Alright, plain and simple. What is that? Moon Curse. Moon Emblem is unusable. What? Does that mean you can't use it again? I don't know. Moon, what the fuck is Moon Emblem? Is this the Moon Emblem? Yeah, there's a Moon Emblem. What is going on? Somebody's throwing boomerangs. I didn't really get a good look at this boss fight because, like I said, I did kill them pretty damn fast. I'm going to try my best to not insta-kill them. Because if we use the Executioner's Blade, there's definitely going to be some insta-killing insta popping off. Maybe not insta-killing, but really fast killing. So we kill Nuba Shadow. Kill Voxa. Now, all of these guys are based off of uh, one of the pillars, and they got no Vanyl. 150 seconds to defeat him. Okay. So, we gotta go kind of fast for him. It's like uh, the end of uh, Spirit of Chaos. What the hell's the name of that other one? Spirit of Chaos. I was right. No, Sacred Tools boss. Might as well use a Sacred Tools weapon. I can see Sacred Tools boss. There you go. We done did it. The music sounds bumping. You can probably listen to that somewhere. Um, let me actually take off the soul of the void let's go for instant kill here let's see how fast we can do it let's see how fast we can do this this is probably my highest dps weapon next to nunderson's glove i think with nunderson's glove i should just throw out sh uh like the big shurikens every now and then just to have them just floating around so if anyone walks into them that's a lot of damage being sent off all right there you go we killed him quick that was I know some people can't sit through a whole episode. I killed him quick for you. First couple minutes of the episode. Boom. Lunarian's trophy. This is a cool looking trophy. It's not like all the other ones. It's a banner. Cool. I like it. It's interesting. It's a change in things. Uh, we got all these lunar coins we can use. Let's open up, open up the treasure bag. Special cosmic cloud bracelet. It's a magic weapon. Oh my god. It is indeed a magic weapon. Okay, something's been happening with my, uh, with these things, the target dummies. Their hitboxes keep on changing location. See, look. <laughs> I'm shooting, I'm shooting this direction, I'm right here, and it's hitting the back one. I don't know why. It's been happening a lot recently. I have no idea why. Luminous energy. Ooh. Ooh. That energy so luminous. We can finally buy that, I think. Do we buy that? I don't know. I have no idea. We can make Cosmic Desolation. We can finally upgrade our Great Lance of Terra. 
amazing is that what it's called i don't know if that's what it's called i'm gonna assume that's what it's called let's go ahead let's sell that and that we don't really need it and now let's go ahead let's deposit all oh wait there was big potions in there was there big potions i don't know we're gonna go in here and we're gonna take uh lunar coins all of them that we've been hoarding up all 400 of them you can't put them in there let's talk to right here nuba 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 i don't know she spawned during the stream and yeah look at that oh we need an infusion crystal for that what the fuck is that gold you can just buy that bolivian shard shouldn't keep this near you while sleeping crystalline bars nice quasar monolith hell yeah let's buy one of those all right so crystalline bars we can finally get some they're pretty cheap five coins a pop and we need 20 for this what other throwing weapons are there so it's 20 for that one i'm getting a phone call hold up all right so we need 20 and 10 so that's 30 there's these wings i don't really care about the wings so 30 i don't know what this is this looks interesting lunar vault hmm all right so 30 we'll do all right i guess we'll get 50 now boom 50 complete i want to see what this does i'm assuming it makes the sky look like what all the other monoliths do makes it look interesting whoa that's insane so insane i'm not even gonna have it there i'm not even gonna have it on all right so uh let me let's do where's the rainstone boom Ooh, calamity cal calamitous essence i'm not gonna touch that uh i'll just watch the stream guys i swear i promise it'll be easier i'm gonna put the clip of me finding the lunarians for the first time at the end of this video but yeah let's go ahead let's do it let's run those cheeks why did i zoom out to zoom back in i don't know quasar sigil we're gonna start with that so we'll take this we'll just put like 30 bars in there 35 bars nice and nice easy amount throw that in there all right hopefully we can make it does not seem like we can make it what am i missing L lunatic infuser how do i get that <laughs> what, do, what do i do how do i get that lunatic infuser one infusion crystal what the fuck is an infusion crystal what is that i am in the dark here maybe i have one just chilling in here nope uh i hope the mod at one point tells you how to get it and that you're not that you don't have to use a wiki that like you're mandatory to use the wiki i'm gonna assume that we get it from my boy bear bear boy that's what i'm gonna assume hey what's up man I s okay hold up he's got a music box music box serpent tail Feather suits, talents. <laughs> Hold on, let's put these on. Let's just see what we look like real quick. Ooh. Ooh, look at that feather suit. It kind of looks pretty cool. I like the colors. The colors are not bad. But I'd rather have a tail. Who the fuck doesn't want a tail? Ew. The tail moves so fast because we move so fast. All right, I got to look it up on the wiki. I'll be right back. Remember a long time ago when we got that mysterious gem? from uh, the panda person yeah this is when you get to use it so if you forgot about it <laughs> there there it is i don't know i feel like there needs to be something more clear about it because uh i don't know maybe maybe someone doesn't have access there and i don't know there's a lot of things that's like that but it's all good we can we can we can buy the thing now boom and uh, we place it. It looks really cool. I just want to place it to show you how it looks. Boom. It's pretty sweet. No, we'll keep it there for now. No, we won't. I'm lying. We're going to put it in the machine. Uh, what do I take out? This probably. Actually. That. Take that out. Boom. That's in there. Now, let's go ahead and... I already forgot what we were making. Quasar. Fuck. Still can't make it. <laughs> what am I missing now? We got the infuser. Ah, we don't have enough quasar fragments. I was about to say. Uh, let's go ahead and talk to Nuba. Luckily, we can just talk to her. Nuba? I feel like it's Nuba. Nuba sounds right. We're going to talk to her and just buy a couple quasar fragments. And now we should finally be good to go. 
Hopefully. We better be. I'm tired of having to. Not yet. We're, we're good. We're good. Boom. This is Sigil's 25% increased stone damage, 10% increased stone crit. Uh, does as much as that, but this one gives it crit damage. And it's also material. Ooh, Bass's scroll. We, we, I can make it right now, but like I said, I'm not going to use that essence. Uh, if you watch the live stream, you'll know why I won't use the essence. We're going to wait until the actual boss fight. We're going to wait for the actual boss fight. Now, moving on. What was the other thing I wanted to make? It was a throwing weapon. Was it the orbital or something? No, that's the orbital destruction. I don't remember the name of the weapon. Cosmic Desola Desolation. Cosmic Desolation. Okay. So let's put the orbital destruction back in here. And let's hit it up. Cosmic Desolation. I bet we need something else. We're missing something, aren't we? Nope, we're just missing more Quasar Fragments. It's all good. You can get those fairly easily for, for a sturdy, steep price of my lunar coin, sadly. Look low key, we're running low on those. Alright. Back to what we were doing though. Cosmic Desolation. There we go. Look at this beauty. Twelve hundred damage. Oh my. Oh my. Look at what's going on. I don't know which one does more damage. You know, I'd love to put a glyph on it, but ever since my uh, NPC died from one of those spirits or wraiths, whatever they're called, nightmare wraiths, uh, I've just not been able to eat glyphs. It's all good. They'll, she'll return eventually. All right, so we can stuff those in there. Do I have lunar coins in here? Or were they stuffed inside of my AE system the whole time? I think they were in the AE system. One more thing I want to make this right here lunar vault this band hammer sounds pretty cool too it's a hammer it's just straight up a hammer that's dope uh this, there's only one throwing weapon it looks like so it better be amazing it better be fucking amazing okay lunar vault let's make it what does it do who knows there it is it just says can be placed it's just a chest really <laughs> That's kind of upsetting. Uh, I don't know. Put it here. Well, what use do I have from this? Not, not really any. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna put it away. All right. So let me reforge this. Get a nice reforge on it. Warding, preferably. That's the nicest one, in my opinion. Maybe I'll do a playthrough where I don't get any warding, but that means I need some good defense. I think I'm gonna get rid of this. Yeah, probably not. Well, let's see here. Let me see something. We do 551. I take this off. We do 503. Um, so it's 503 with that on. We put this on. We do 503. So yeah, it should be the same damage. We're gonna have the void in this switch out. The only thing about the void, the only thing about Fargo's mod in general is this. I have to check these off every single time and it's really fucking annoying. Like, it's so annoying. <laughs> it's like 30 clicks just for one thing. Alright, so, all my NBCs are reappearing. That's always nice to see. Uh, what, can we, what else can we do this episode? I don't know. I really don't know. I feel like we should just see what other weapons they drop. If we can get any other weapons. So, why not do that? Why not? We'll fight them two more times to end off the episode. You guys get to see me fight it the first time. Uh, and we're going to use this weapon new weapon why not use it oh my god they're getting destroyed we're already at no vanille. it homes in oh my god oh my god that's that's some unfair shit right there <laughs> it home it chases enemies slash homes whatever you want to say it says chase but uh that's it's pretty damn insane so that many projectiles and they're like chase an enemy at the same time like geez that's pretty damn crazy okay so we're gonna place a gnome camp be let's see if they drop anything else no mask hey look at me it's me no vanil tricked you guys it's me nunderson actually uh yeah none of those we're not gonna use any of those something those we're not really gonna use 
go ahead and hit that deposit. I mean, there, that's a nice way to farm coins, I guess. To drop a decent amount of coins. But, uh, like, 24 from 2. I think it's like 12 each is what we got right there. Let's place another campfire. Let's do three gnomes. It's been a while since we've done three gnomes. I have no idea where I'm going to place them, though. Do I not have... No, okay. We good, we good. Let me see. Let's zoom out. I've done one in the dungeon. Oh, the spirit biome. Oh, wait. There's one right there. <laughs> Duh, I've done them in, like, nearly every biome. So we can hit up that granite biome. I don't know why this stuff is all blue. Uh, we can hit up the granite biome. Or a marble biome. I think that's what we should do. Mm, where's a marble biome? There's one here. What is that? It's, that's a campfire. I guess that's where I fought that one boss. Uh, let's do the marble biome right here. Or uh, granite biome. The granite biome next to spawn. Why did I do that? I didn't need to do that. Actually, hold up. Before we do that. Let's do granite. Let's make some granite platforms. Just to... just Those are some big ass boots. Those granite greaves. So I got some big boots. Okay, hold up. Where the... Here we go. Like four, just in case. But let's hit it up. F quick fall fast. Remember when we used to fall fast? Hey, this is the first set of gnomes. I gave up on that stucco idea where, like, it looked like the colors of the gnomes would take over the world. That's a lot of work, guys. <laughs> but I bet if I did it when we first, like, set up the gnomes, I bet it probably would have looked pretty nice. Slowly infesting the world. Okay, maybe not look nice, but it would have looked cool. Let's put them, uh, down here. Right here seems good. I'll let, I'll let those chase down the enemies. Uh, we need to kind of open up a little space, though. Just, just a wee bit of space. You know, just make everything look nice. I like to have my gnomes in a nice terraformed area. Okay, it doesn't look that nice. Probably because it's not flattened. So let's, let's just break that block right there. There you go. It looks beautiful. Let's place a campfire here. Oh, a gnome doesn't fit in that little spot. Okay. A little bit more to the right. There you go. Boom. Boom. And then hit him with a nice little platform right here. Boom. The gnomes, man, they're taking over. They're everywhere. They are everywhere. We're going to have an episode where we try to find all of them. At least attempt. There's been at least... I don't know how many gnomes there is. If there's 100 or if there's 50. I think it's 100. I think I placed around 100. But one more thing before you end off the episode. I got to hit up the I got to hit up the altar. Looks like there's a bigger gathering coming around here. I think uh, these gnomes are going to be. What's the word upgraded? Not upgraded. Their ranking in the gnome society is going to go up. And these I think these gnomes are going to be become a part of the council, the main council. If you guys remember David. You remember the Council of Gnomes. So, I'm going to end the episode off here. Here comes the clip. Br Do the clip of me fighting the boss. Moon Emblem spawns in the Moon Empire, also known as the Lunarians. The Lunarians. I don't know how it's pronounced. Let's run it. We're doing this on a stream because I'm being forced to by gunpoint. Uh, we're going to use the orbital destruction for this fight. Why am I fighting them in space? I mean, it makes sense. They're Lunarians. Lunarians. One of them is named Nuba. What the fuck kind of name is that? It's not like an Italian person calling you a noob or something. <laughs> Use a nuba. Oh, I'm hilarious, thank you. Dustile. Is that that guy's name? Solarius Voxa. Interesting names. This was the easiest goddamn fight. This is easy. Well, what's going on with the background? Hold up. There's more. No vaniel. Yo, the background looks sweet. What the hell is going on back there? Oh my god. Oh my god. He keeps teleporting where I want to go. Alright, we're going to use an Undersynth Glove. No, we're not. We're going to use this. Undersynth Glove almost insta kill. We're using weaker weapons. Where's he at? Where you at, boy? What do you say? I made it quieter? I don't like bosses that talk to me. Don't talk to me, alright? Not you're not actually real, so stop trying to interact with me. <laughs> we done did it.